notification tutorial on something that you can do with your clay. So you're going to want to go and grab your clay, open it up. I used some scissors just to make it that bit easier and got my clay out. I didn't want to use all my clay, so I needed to spill, but I rolled it into a ball and then I kneaded it for a bit and started to roll it into my little snake rolls. And when you knead it, it helps it and makes it a lot easier to actually make your little snakes. Then I went in to make my base of my pot and I rolled it into a little ball and then flattened it out as much as I could. It's not too thin though, don't want to have it too thin. And then I started putting my first snake around the pot to get the outing of the pot. And then you're just going to want to keep rolling up some more snakes and then wrapping it round and building it up from there. So once I finished building my walls on my pot, I decided to go in with a little bit of water just to make it a bit more smoother on the outside. So if you want to go and grab some water and put some on my fingertips and then rubbed over any of the little cracks in the, in the pot and just made it that bit smoother and a bit nicer. So once you're happy with your pot, you're going to want to leave it to dry for 24 hours and then you can decorate it, you can do whatever you like with it, but your pot is finished.